Schaffner here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my outfit diary and welcome to a very special video for me. This is my very first collaboration video. I'm so excited about it. I feel like a real live YouTuber. Today's video is in collaboration with Tiffany from PK Mom Life. I will put her channel's name on the screen as well as in the description box below. I really hope that you will visit Tiffany's channel, check out her video, her outfit diaries. Today we are doing all of our outfits with thrifted items. Yes. This week Tiffany and I agreed to style all our outfits using at least one item that was thrifted. Right Tiffany? Is that the rules? That's the way I understood it. And Tiffany has been out shopping. She has shown some previews on her channel of pieces that she has picked up at Goodwill. I was really inspired and I wanted to go back to Goodwill but all I got was six pieces and a broken bag. <laughs> and I am going to try to style these six pieces into my outfits. Now, you will get to see pieces that I have picked up in my shopping halls and my style boxes in this week's outfit because six pieces, I can't wear the same six pieces over and over again. But I'm just hoping that five of them work because we will be showing five outfits this week using thrifted items. Okay. Let me show you what I got. Okay, first piece is a little button down. Um, this is a striped collared button up. This is by Relativity and I got it because it's my size and I like the colors. Feels like a springtime piece. So I don't have the price tag. I paid $27 for these six pieces. I am not a super professional thrifter. I don't go on the right days. I wish I knew which days to go, but I just popped in and picked up some pieces. So I got this piece and this piece does not have a label on it. This is a tank and it is a textured tank. It has got brown and some teal and some tans in it. And I love the way that it feels. I really hope I can put this in this week's outfit diary because I like this one. The next piece is by a brand called Miss Bella D. This is a super sheer top but it does have it's a beautiful floral isn't it and it has that cross front detail it is a little bit longer in the back it is a flowy piece and i think it would look really nice with a lime colored tank underneath i don't think i have a lime colored tank so i've got to figure out a way to style that one this one of course, I had to get this one because of the texture on the front of it. This is by L, and this one is in a size large, a little bit too big for me, I think. I hope I can make it work. I might have to actually alter it, uh, but can you see the detail on the front of the blouse? That's what I like about this, and it does have just the plain back, so yeah, it's a crew neck. Hopefully it's not going to be too big and I can make this one work. I like this bright white tank. Another tank top. This one is by the brand Pretty Good. It's a heathered brown fabric and then we do have that floral detail on the side. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I This one I got for like $1.98. So yeah, I, don't, I, I will wear this this summer. Let's see how I style it this week. Okay, the last piece I got, this is the most expensive piece that I got. I paid $6 and some change for these denim. These are a black straight leg denim. They are by NYDJ, not your daughter's jeans. Can you believe that? I picked up NYDJ for less than $7. These are in my size. They are a black denim. They need to be cleaned. They have the five pocket styling and they are stretchy. They do have a embellished pockets. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. Again, these are also a straight leg and these are a petite size and I am not petite. I am five foot seven. So I saw these, the price was too good to pass up and I thought, there's a project. I am going to turn these denim into a fabulous 
pair of jeans, okay? Just stick around all week, watch the outfits, check out Tiffany's channel and how we style our Goodwill clothing into our everyday life. Total price of this haul, $27. Hey everyone, it is Monday and this is my outfit today. You recognize the top? Guys, this is such a special day. Today is Elijah's fourth birthday. We really celebrate here in the Schaffner house. We are having steaks for dinner and yes, all of the puppies are having steaks as well and we are going on an extra long walk in the park. I mean, we are really going to lay our work aside today and celebrate our puppies with Elijah in mind. Anyway, this is my outfit today. And I'll start on the bottom. On the bottom, these are some espadrille wedges. These are by Forever 21 and they're just in a really nude neutral color and I like them. They're very comfortable. These pants, does anyone remember these pants? I got them from Stitch Fix and the brand is called Rev Fry. This is the second time I have worn them and I'm just not real crazy about them. Again, that lighter color denim. I I think these pants are seriously going to go in my Poshmark closet. The cardigan that I'm wearing is staccato. Love it. I think it kind of ties everything together. It makes me a little bit more confident about wearing these pants today. And this top, this is a top I got from Goodwill. I paid about $4 for this top. $4 for most of the tops. One tank I got for $2. I did look up this brand. It is sold at Macy's. This is the sleeveless top and I love the colors. That's why I bought it. I normally enjoy a sleeveless button up in the spring and summer. I'm really drawn to these colors as well. It's not a good fit for me. I do have some pulling right through here and yet I don't like the look of it unbuttoned like that. I also think it's a little bit too short for me. I, I just not, I'm just not crazy about it. So I will wear it today. I did commit to wearing one thrifted piece per day this entire week in my outfit. So this is it. This is my happy birthday Elijah outfit. I will see you tomorrow with something else from my thrift haul. Hi everyone, it's Tuesday, day two of our outfit challenge, wearing a piece of thrifted clothing. And today I am wearing this tank or sleeveless top that has the most fabulous texture. I wish you could feel the texture on this tank. It also has a bit of a lettuce hem. Uh, that's the way I'm seeing it, I don't know. And it has just hints of teal going through it. So you notice I am wearing some teal jewelry. These are throwback, I think from the 80s. My mother gave me a bunch of fashion jewelry that she no longer wears, so I try to wear it every chance I get. The necklace is actually a piece I picked up at Mint Mongoose. And do you guys recognize this sweater? This is Time and True from Walmart. This one is a size large, and I wasn't sure if I should keep it or not, but I think it kind of brings out the blue in this top, so I'm liking that. And on the bottom, I am wearing my Carlos Santana brown booties and the jeans are Liverpool. These are a straight leg, which I don't normally reach for. I know my viewers seem to love it when I wear straight legs, probably balances out my figure a little bit more. So I'm feeling kind of pulled together. I love this thrifted top. What do you think? What do you think about the outfit today is tax day. I am preparing my mother's taxes today, so wanted to be comfortable, but we will also go out for lunch once that's finished. So this is it. This is the tax preparer's outfit. I'll see you Hi everyone. It is day three of my outfit challenge with Tiffany from PK Mom Life. Make sure you visit her channel and check out how she wore her thrifted items all week. So today I am wearing the L blouse and I like this blouse. I love white. I especially like to wear it in the spring and summer. It just feels so very fresh and I don't think you can have too many white blouses. Now this one isn't a size large, so it's a little bit big for me. I will alter it if I decide to keep it beyond wearing it today. And I won't make that decision until the end of the day if I enjoyed wearing it. But I love this textured 
fabric and this blouse is lined you know honestly a cardigan is in order today it is sunshiny and beautiful but it's still too chilly for me to go with a sleeveless blouse without a cardigan so i am wearing my halogen cardigan can you say turquoise today is a turquoise day on the bottom I am wearing some old sandals. These are actually a satin turquoise sandal with some gold chains around them. These are by Ziggy Soho. I bought these to go with one dress and I have worn them with so many more outfits. I'm also wearing my No Boundary. No, 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 I'm sorry. These are time and true. These are from Walmart, these turquoise pants and the longer I wear them, the more comfortable they are, and yet the waistband is not stretching out. So these have turned out to be a really great find. I'm real happy with them. I look at this outfit and I think it needs a pendant necklace, but I opted for something different. I am wearing this gemstone necklace that I picked up at the loft, some gemstone earrings that I've had for a long time, just to give me a little bit more color than turquoise. So here you have it, turquoise overload. I'll see you tomorrow. Thursday, and this is Thursday's outfit. Yeah, I am finding a way to incorporate all of my Goodwill finds into my weekly wardrobe. So it's working out, here it is guys. Oh, I did wanna mention, I have a lot of clothing behind me because I have some great videos coming up. All of this is vacation wear, so I will be sharing with you my vacation packing and what I plan on taking on vacation and all of this over here is my viewers have styled me and the packages are coming in I can't wait to film it make sure that you're subscribed so you can see all of this great clothing especially this okay back to my outfit on the bottom I'm wearing my Mia flats and you guys these flats have come in so handy. They are not comfortable for walking long distances, but they're very comfortable if I'm just wearing them at home or on a regular day. My husband took me out one day, I was wearing these and we ended up walking several miles and these were not comfortable, but I just think they pair so nicely with anything with green in it. The denims are J brand, yeah, back to my dark denim and I am wearing an olive colored cami under this really lightweight Bella D. Miss Bella D is the brand on this. This is a cross front top, but isn't it so spring-like? So I really enjoy all the fun colors on this. You guys, I am wearing all of my Fair Trade Friday jewelry today. The little earrings, these are the monkey knot, and I also have the bracelet. If you haven't seen those videos, Please take a look at those videos. I will link them at the end of this video. And so truthfully, I will need a cardigan when I leave the house today. It's just too chilly to go without. I don't want to wear a heavy jacket. Let me show you what I'm going Okay, with. here is the cardigan that I selected. As I was trying to pick a cardigan, I realized every cardigan I thought would match and pair nicely with this blouse. I've already worn this week, so I'm wearing my time and true again because I think it's the one that matches the shoes and the blouse the very best. So true confession, there are weeks where I wear the same piece more than once and I actually see the same people. Yeah, okay, just keeping it real here. You guys show up tomorrow, you may see this one again. Or maybe not. We'll see you tomorrow. Hi everyone, it's Friday. First, a little housekeeping. I did want to point out, this is an Elijah. Yeah, Elijah wanted my attention. I wasn't paying attention to him, so he poked me in the eye. That will probably be there for a week. You guys know I'm bruisers. Also, I'm trying to decide upon earrings, if I should wear these fringe earrings today or my Nadine West earrings. I'm more comfortable with this length, but I love these and I think they pair nicely with this polka dot top. So I know by the time you tell me which one you like, it's going to be too late. I am leaning towards wearing the tassels just because I like every opportunity to wear tassels. Let okay, so I put the tassels on because that's actually what I think I will wear today because I want to wear my little tassel necklace. Guys, thank you so much for sticking around for all five days of my outfit diaries and this collaboration with Tiffany from PK Mom Life. 
be certain to visit her channel. Tell her Kelly Schaffner sent you. Show her some love. It's been a lot of fun collaborating with Tiffany and doing something fresh and new for our viewers and for our channels. And it was challenging for me as well because when I open new clothes, I normally want to wear them right away. I really hope that you have enjoyed this. If you do, hey, the outfit. Here is my outfit. The thrifted piece are the pants, but on the bottom, I have the Tom's Espadrille sandals. I wasn't sure if I was going to purchase them. I did purchase them, very comfortable, but the pants. This is my thrifted piece. These are NYDJ jeans. I got these for less than $7. Now, I also bought them in a petite size, so they were far too short, like flood, yeah, high water short. They didn't look good on me. These are straight leg. So I decided to try my hand at distressing a pair of denims, and I'm surprised how easy it was. I will share that with you in a video. I did document it and film it as I was doing it, so once I get that put together, I would love to share it with you. I hope you're interested because it is so easy. So these are straight leg, like I said, and I enjoy something a little bit different, but the benefit of distressed straight legs are that your toes don't go in the holes as you put them on. That's a plus. Now also, I did want these at a cropped length. I wanted them to look intentionally short. So I did fray the bottoms and I put some distressing in the knees. And also there's one hole back here. And then I sanded the Places that get the most wear, like the fly and around the pockets and stuff like that on the seams. So yeah, I am pretty happy with these. I am so excited to have a premium pair of denim that now work for me. What do you think? I know some of you don't like distressed denim at all and I am enjoying it more and more. Maybe because I just needed a change. So yeah, um, this is my thrift store pants and on the top I am wearing my polka dot top that I picked up at Amazon with these excellent sleeves. This is style dome. This piece of jewelry is from a friend. These tassels it's always fun to wear. So this is it guys. This is Friday's outfit. We are going out to lunch. I had a girlfriend that was a buyer for a very very large clothing company and I asked her about the rules on long dangly earrings and she said there are no rules. We can wear whatever we want. But she said that normally you wouldn't wear a longer length earring like this until dinner time, like after five. And we are meeting friends for lunch. Should I do it? Should I break the rules? Let me know. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I sure hope you will subscribe and join me for future videos. I have a lot of fun fashion to share with you. Until we meet again, blessings. Blessings to all.